we all are attracted to San Luis Obispo because of the environment. We want to protect what we have here. As an early adopter of 3CE, I think the city took a leap of faith. It was a smart move. And I think that it's important for everybody to jump on board because it's, it's a time where we need to make leaps towards a greener future. When I first started in 2015, we had oh, a very old fleet, mostly diesel, and now we started to go electric. It makes good sense. The kids here wanted to see electric, but I think the public should realize where the funding is coming from. You don't want to force people to do something. You want businesses to actually believe in that mission and that value. So having incentive-based programs really promotes businesses to find that as something valuable and integrate into their program. We've partnered with Central Coast Community Energy for agri-electrification. Seeing a program that was going to be able to help us move towards a more sustainable operation, plus having that cost share, it seemed like a no-brainer to me. La casa para mí es donde está mi familia, es donde puedo ser yo misma, y en ese lugar es el corazón de la familia. We're at Riverview Estates 2. This is a mutual self-help housing development for low to very low income home buyers, where the home buyers actually do 65% of the construction on their homes. Everyone works on everyone's home. No one moves in until the last home is done. It's a true community, it's a true group effort. It was exciting, it was hard, you know, you got sunburned, you were sore. <laughs> the families did all the hard work. They were yeah. out here every weekend for about 18 months. I believe you were in college, right, in Sacramento? Yeah, my last year. So you got your degree while you were building the house? Yep, double major, criminal justice and sociology. The homes are all electric, working with 3CE. We excluded any gas. With the panels, you're saving money, but you're also helping the environment, which is incredible. We took a chance, as most families did, and look at us, 24 houses and 24 families living happily in their home. <laughs>